Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, I'm Marco Lover, and in this video, I'll be teaching you guys how to paint my BTS Black Swan inspired design. This is inspired by the music video that the members started themselves, so without further ado, let's get started. Start by applying base coat, I'm using Unk Peel Off Base Coat, which is always linked in the description box. Next, I'm going to be painting my index and pinky fingernails a shimmery gold, and the rest of my nails black. Now for this design, I decided to split up the seven members across all five nails instead of just doing four and then doing like OT7 on my thumbnail because I wanted to do Timin on my thumbnail, which you guys will see. But basically, I'm going to be painting Namjoon on my index fingernail. And uh, basically, I started with his head and now I'm going to be painting his body, which is just donned in like a black suit. So... Yes, the hardest part of Namjoon is honestly his hand, like he has his hand on his face and it's just so difficult painting the hand on a small scale. So I'm sorry if it looks like a chicken foot, it is not intended, it's just what happened and I really tried my best. And I'm also using like lighter shades, like you can say like really dark grays to add shading. And I also added his ears and his hair which is a light purple and I'll be adding like different shades of brown to add like his roots or like you know the deeper parts of the hair and then I'm taking a gunmetal foil polish and I'm going to be framing the snail as well as adding some crisscross designs behind Namjoon and this is just mimicking like the mirror design in Jin's scene for the middle fingernail I'm going to be drawing Hobie and Jungkook so I'm starting with Hobie and then I'll draw Jungkook afterwards. And now I'm going to be adding his brown hair, which is styled in the usual way, so you want to do this sort of off-centered. And now I'm going to be adding his clothing, so I'm starting with like a really dark gray, and then I'll slowly, you know, add lighter grays, and I'll also add glitter for the accents on the clothing. Now I'm going to be adding shading to his jaw area and I'll highlight the edge of his face. And now moving on to Jungkook, I'm going to be drawing him slightly above Hobie just to make things a little bit more interesting. Now we're going to add in his hair which is a really dark blue. So I went back in with a flesh tone to add his ear and I'm using a dark gray for his clothing. Just adding shading in his jaw area as well as highlights like I did for Hobie. Adding some shine to his hair. Now for the ring fingernail, I'm going to be drawing V and Shuba. So I'm starting at the lower left corner for V and he is sitting down so he's in a slightly different position. And he's also looking to the left. However, that does not change how we paint him at all. For Shula, just the way his head is angled in that shot of the music video is slightly different from the rest of the members, so we'll take that into account and his will be slightly different as you can see. So can I just say that I really like how I added in Shuga's hair, like the color in my opinion is just spot on and you can see that after I add the darker like silver shades, it just comes to life. And now I'm going to be painting my pinky fingernail design, so this is going to be of course Jin since we have Timon on our thumbnail. So I'm starting with his head and he's kind of in a similar position to Namjoon to be honest, so you can apply you know the similar technique and it's really great because these two nails frame the design so we have kind of like mirroring designs and also it helps that the background is a mirror so that's cool and I really like drawing in Jin's hair because he has a mullet right now so it just it's really easy to differentiate between the members
like we did for the index fingernail, I'm going to draw a frame around Jin using this gunmetal foil polish. Now onto the thumbnail, I'm going to be drawing a very sexy, almost lethal shot of Tsumin, and that is when he like bends back and the wings sprout from his back, and he's also wearing a corset, so it is very much lethal. But anyways, I'm using a dark gray, and I'm going to be marking out his body, and then on top, I'm adding black for where the corset sits. And then behind him, of course, I'm using a kind of muted blue like a really dark blue polish for the wings and you just want to like mark out where they are very roughly and then use your brush and just dab on small amounts of the polish to add texture so that it looks like feathers. I went in with white polish to add some highlights on both the wings and Simon's body. Next, we'll be adding in his hair and a bit of shading on his under jaw area. Now all you have to do is apply a generous layer of top coat, making sure you float the brush across your design so as not to smear them. So that is it for my BTS Black Swan inspired nail art design. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video as well as the previous Black Swan design inspired by the art film. But anyways, that's it and I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye everyone!